What, did you, what would you say is the best way that in our everyday lives we can help veterans, you know, that are coming back and, you know? I would say always, first and foremost, work with the organizations that are in your local community because they're going to help the people from your community. That's where you need to start. Uh, and then a lot of those have branched off into larger organizations and never ever be embarrassed, scared, or afraid to say thank you. It does mean a lot. You might not think it, and even some of the soldiers I've talked to go, man, it's a little embarrassing, but they remember it. And it does mean a lot. It, I mean, it, it's amazing what a simple thank you. I mean, gosh, man, we talk about doing it to our military. I think we should be doing that more often to everyone. There's nothing wrong with the guy opening the door and saying thank you when they do that. Gratitude all around. I'm telling you, there, we should be a more grateful nation. We, are, we live in the greatest place in the world. You know, yeah. so we should we should express that gratitude, and and especially to the men and women that are serving. And there's ways to do it outside of just a thank you. Man, if you you know if you have the money and you see a guy standing in front of you, you know, buy his coffee. That that means a lot, you know, to a soldier. It makes him feel like what he's doing is worthy.